Hi guys, I'm Tasha from Travelin' Tash. As a YouTuber, I spend a lot of time outside and time on camera, and I don't want to get too wrinkled, and I also don't want to get too pimply, so I have to be really picky and choosy about what products I put on my skin. And that said, I've recently collaborated with one of my favourite skincare brands, Isntree. I'm really, really pleased because I genuinely like this skincare brand. I've recently been gifted some skincare products by them. These are some sunscreens that I'd like to share with you and review and give you my honest feedback, my honest opinion on how these perform. I'm only going to recommend products that I think work really well on my really, really, really sensitive acne prone skin. I'm going to guess that most of you don't have the challenges that I do. Hopefully I can give you some really good information that's going to actually be useful to you. This is the first product. It's the Hyaluronic natural sunscreen. On the package it says it evens out skin tone, it's a lightweight sunscreen and it replenishes moisture. This is a mild mineral sunscreen that's really safe for sensitive skin and that's why I started with this one. I have extremely sensitive skin and so I have to be really careful what I put on it, particularly on my face. This one is made of 17% zinc oxide and zinc oxide is one of those products that is a very, very good ingredient for anybody that has particularly sensitive skin. A lot of mineral sunscreens will have a kind of tacky or sticky feeling to it and this one has a less of a sticky feeling than most. The consistency is a tiny little bit heavy. It has a kind of milky translucency. It doesn't feel sticky at all though. Let's compare that now to a chemical sunscreen. It's the Hyaluronic Acid Watery Sun Gel. It replaces moisture and it has eight types of hyaluronic acid and it has no white cast. We're expecting it to be 100% completely transparent. Amazon voted this particular product, the Watery Sun Gel, as number one under their sunscreen category. It spreads really easily. The gel makes it particularly spreadable. And as it spreads, it looks completely transparent on the skin. The texture is much thinner, much lighter. It leaves a shiny sheen to your skin. The last product that we're reviewing is the Hyaluronic Acid airy sun stick by Isntree. This size is much smaller, the other ones are a 50 ml. It reminds me a little bit of a deodorant, but it's very, very handy and you know that this isn't gonna spill in your bag. I also really like the size, so as a traveler, I don't like to carry really heavy things. I travel with really small cameras and as little as possible because I don't like to be burdened down with stuff. It feels very moisturizing and silky. All three of them are so completely different. The mineral sun cream has the heaviest application and a slightly milky residue. The watery sun gel leaves a really nice glossy sheen and I think that that would be really really nice particularly for ladies like on your legs to give you like a sexy legs kind of look. This particular product, I think that due to the shape, it's really, really ideal for applying to your face because it's um, it points down to a tip and I think that you can move around your cheekbones and your forehead and get into smaller spaces more easily. So you can use that tip to get in towards your eye. That shape is absolutely perfect because you can pretty much access all parts of your face without having to actually touch your face, which means that you're not putting any, you're not transferring any bacteria. It feels like I do have something on there. So for the natural sun cream, it feels like there's something there, but it's not bothersome. For the watery gel, it feels like there's nothing there. If typically you really dislike the feeling of anything on your skin, I would go with the watery sun gel. If you are a traveler and you really don't like to carry anything remotely heavy, this is a very, very nice ideal size. It does leave a little bit of a film on your face. For me, it's not bothersome. I really like the shape of it and I like the fact that I can apply it without using my fingers. For families, I would say that the natural sun cream is probably your way to go because you know it's very unlikely that you'll have any kind of 
allergic reaction because this really performs extremely highly on the sensitive skin test. This is a difficult choice for me to decide which one I like the most. I like them all, but I think that my favourites would be the watery sun gel, particularly for your legs <laughs> and for ladies that is, and the sun stick, the airy sun stick by Isn't Tree for your face. Those are my favourites. Thank you so much for watching. If you want more information about where to find Isn't Tree products, I'll leave some information in the description below. Guys, thank you so much for watching. You can expect more reviews coming soon. I do really love this skincare brand, so I'm gonna be sharing more information about what I like from their brand.